Hey guys, Jim Halterman from TV Guide Magazine and TV Insider. I'm here with Deidre Hall and Robert Scott Wilson from Days of Our Lives. I want. I want. What do you want, sweetheart? I, I want. So good to see you guys in person, first of all. You too, man. Jim, um, thank you. So nice to be uh, here. It's a pleasure. Um, first talk to me, Days went to Peacock in September. The show is, I think it's captivating as ever. But what have you been hearing from the fans? Because I know it was a whole thing to like get them to kind of understand we're, we're going to be airing somewhere else. But can you talk to that a little bit? What I think you meant to say is it's killing it on Peacock. It's killing it. <laughs> okay. Um, we got number one. I just saw it. Yesterday it was sent to me. We're number one on Peacock right now. That's amazing. It's unbelievable. Yeah. So thank you guys and thank you for sticking with us and everybody. So, so far so good. Um, yeah. yeah, it's been a challenge for the fans and we knew it would be when it happened. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, because to get Peacock, to uh, subscribe it, to find it, to change that habit of 54 years, mm -hmm. 54, 55, whatever it was, is hard. Because people are used to coming into their house, yeah. sitting down, turning on their VCR, turning on the television, right. there we are. Yeah. Monday morning, there we aren't. I know. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, and, you, and you said killing it, and I'm like, but they keep killing people off. Kate has died, Kayla has died, Marlena just died. How long have you been watching Days of Our Lives? A long time. Okay. I, I know, I know what it means calm, when people Stay calm, carry die. on. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> So, uh, you know, what we're seeing on the show now is we know Marlena is, is maybe gone from Earth, but she's in heaven. Um, can you talk about the, what, what we'll see when she's in heaven? Because it gives, I think, the fans hope that she's not really gone, but I'm guessing there's some things that are going to be going on up there. Hmm. Well, she is with uh, Kate and Kayla. So just as an actor, let me just say, oh my gosh, what fun was that? <laughs> oh my gosh, what fun was that? Not just because I love those two women more than anything, but because we don't get to uh, circulate. We don't get to hang out together. Yeah. So all of a sudden to be on stage with two of my dearest friends, so much fun. And they, and they couldn't throw us off because we were working. <laughs> um, having said that, that was a lovely part. The, the not lovely part was um, in heaven there are no chairs or benches and if you walk to heaven in your heels <laughs> it just isn't fun <laughs> you know marlena's still wearing her heels in heaven there you go she is. there you go <laughs> she is. um backing up just a little bit the the scene where marlena does die in john's arms is beautiful it was on the trailer they showed a couple months ago but it's it, it was very heartfelt what's shooting a scene like that do for you as an actor especially when you have drake being the one holding you mm. Well, that's a security blanket right there, is Drake. Um, uh, they they had um, created a, a large number of flashbacks that were their history. That try not to watch it. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! And that that's the show investing in that. That's a lot of man hours to get that kind of thing pulled together, and it was just dreamy and memorable and and deeply moving. It hits me every time because I've watched the show a long time. My mother got me to watch it. So I see those old clips from the 80s and all that, and it hits me. So you're, you're going to get me. I know you are. Uh, oh, yeah. Rob, talk about Alex's journey. Um, you know, he worked so hard to get Stephanie, and then he kind of screwed it up. Yeah, he kind of <laughs> screwed it up. It definitely wasn't as, uh, you know, tugging at the heartstrings as what Deidre and, and Drake were able to accomplish <laughs> recently. Um, you know, they're the epitome of a, of a super couple. Uh, truly, you know, we, that, that term got thrown around a lot. And, um, you know, watching their stuff is just always the best. But Alex-wise, he is a breath of fresh air, man. Um, granted, he kind of messed up things recently with Stephanie. He kind of pulled the bonehead maneuver. But he was in, he was really doing what he thought was okay. He wasn't trying to intentionally hurt anybody with the process. But unfortunately, uh, bad move at the bad time. And uh, that really took him out. Um, so he's going to be making up for that for a while, and uh, I'm sure that will be part of the door opening to therapy with the best doctor in town, <laughs> because the boy needs therapy, and we have just the person for that here. Um, but it's been a, overall, it's just been a blast. I'm super grateful to, to Ron and Al Albert and Janet and Ken for greenlighting it and letting me come back and, and, and do my thing as somebody else and, and work that other side of my craft that um, we haven't seen as much on days. And uh, 
it was like the greatest compliment that they trusted that process in such a quick turnaround. Yeah. So I'm uh, really grateful. Okay. I love it. You guys, Days of Our Lives airs every weekday on Peacock. Thank you, Deidre. Thanks, Rob. Thank you. Good to see you guys, see you as guys. always.